So yes, finally, finally, finally. So of course I'm back on there really quick. Quick, 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 bonkers. Eh. Um, book of my dreams with you. So yeah. Um, the video shouldn't take too, too long to go over just because it's not really a review, technically, if you get technical, but it's just going over all the Chloe episodes pretty much. I'm just gonna talk about it and stuff like that, of course. I'll talk about Chloe, what I think about her. She's pretty much just like a episode I can get everything that out with. Because I think personally for me, I think Chloe pretty much is my favorite Pokemon girl at this point in the series. I don't know, it's just, just so different and that's what I really like about her though. So yeah, I guess I'm talking probably for like 10 minutes probably. You can get that YouTube spicy editor video up there. Yeah, you know what that is. But yeah. Again, just joking around though, pretty much though. So, yeah, again, all of this, I did open up everything just because it really just goes over like everything with Chloe, like everything, like the EV evolutions, um, their episodes, everything pretty much. So, like how they both are pretty much both. I'm just gonna be flipping back and forth, but I'm just, um, yeah, the request Pokemon mascots, Pikachu and Eevee, of course. But yeah, this is one of these videos I can just kind of go all out with. It. It's not a news video, I can relax with this episode. Pretty simple, pretty easy. That's because Sonic Boots because of the background, as always. Hope you guys enjoyed everything. So yeah, of course, let's go ahead and get started, of course. But yeah, pretty short intro too. But yeah, like I said though, because like the next episode right there, we see right there, a little title card piece right there. It's for um, Eevee. So you hear a lot of clicking on my mouse, I've been using that a lot lately. I use it in every video, I just don't click with it, so yeah. But yeah, next episode is Chloe theme. We already knew that was coming up early August. I think it was supposed to be late August, but it's kind of obvious why, just because again, the league and stuff like that. So uh, I feel like this is, again, probably, I really want to say, during the league, uh, not Pokemon League, I really want to say that just because it has nothing to do with like, Ash or Go. I feel like this this is happening, maybe, I feel like it's happening during or sometime before. That's some, probably it's like during slash, probably during the tournament, you know, they'll probably make up like back in time, like, okay, this happened while I should go on to, to tournament. This is happening, like, through every other, other episode, this happened to Chloe pretty much, like, kind of like a time, time skip, time reference thing kind of thing. That's why I want to kind of get it as, because, I feel like it's going to be either that or if it's in the future, you know, Ash can go to the tournament um, while closing her own thing. Because, again, she does have her own life and everything. You gotta kind of realize that. That's probably why they didn't bring her in. I didn't think about that either. I was like, oh yeah, Chloe's not in any of the... I blew my mind because I was like... Oh, holy crap. I was like, Chloe's not in any of the new... Um, she hasn't been in any of the couple episodes lately. So I'm like, okay, they're doing something for her. They have to be doing a special for her. Because, again, at this point in time, you kind of already know that... At some point, okay. there's a lot of cars going back. I throw throwing my head off a little bit. But yeah, because we know Drain's probably going to end this year because of the new games that they kind of want to. Because again, so Garland by the time of recording, it's still coming out in November. And it kind of makes sense. Well, they kind of want to wrap up Drain's this year. I wouldn't mind that because again, they want to give the anime and the games kind of at the same time point preference. If you, if you kind of catch my drift a little bit. Um, they kind of always keep it near their like Sword Shield the anime started way before the games came out, so I feel like they're gonna again if during wrap wraps up here, if we get a couple episodes like on like on the weekend, like a Saturday or Sunday, I'm fine with that. So yeah. Um I wouldn't mind that. Just I kinda wanna keep my points out there a little bit though. But yeah, like I said, that was just going over the episode and stuff like that. We got of course Pokemon mascots again. We do Pikachu D with the mascots at this point. So it, it, because of all the devolutions, Pikachu's just the racking money maker at this point. Like we already know about that though. They're going to go into all the EV evolutions, um, the episodes, or Chloe and stuff like that. Of course, like I said, I don't need to, um, you know, kind of explain everything, of course. Um, the EV episode, which again, I did, I did all these episode reviews for Chloe, and I was like, this one's not, again, I'm going to review this just like I did in a normal during this episode. But I gotta go through like, all this, though, because I already explained everything in the episode anyway, though. It gets more of a special, not a spin off, a special kind of thing, pretty much, for Chloe, though. So I don't need to explain or just kind of go for it, because it literally explains in every episode. How cool you can be met every moment, every piece of it. Every piece of it. Though. My voice is kind of a lot. Oh, wait. Maybe because I've been recording the last couple of days, but I'm done with this episode. Get a good calm video, not a news video, nothing crazy or whatever. I guess I have a lot of videos to record. I have a lot. That's I'm scoring. I have a lot of Dragon Ball Legends videos. But those are like side videos. I don't know. So I don't care. I can do those later. Those will take that long. But it's a lot of reading, though. And, you know, I'm just one guy. I can't do everything, though. So, yeah. Um, what is it down here? Yeah, just all the, oh, yeah, I don't need to explain this. Yeah, this is catching AB and everything. How they bet and everything. Uh, they're pretty much both similar. They don't know what they want to do. Chloe doesn't know what she wants to do. Evie doesn't know what she wants to do in life. So yeah, they even go back to, like, to the water episode, of course. Um, for the Ambi Poor. And again, it's pretty much every Evie ev Evolution episode, pretty much, though. So, yeah. We got Dragon Fishing here, because of Ash and you know, Dragon Fishing episode, pretty much. Because of the you know, episode, she doesn't kind of know what she wants to do as well. Um, again, she's, um, the surfer guy, I don't know his name at all. Um, He's um EB of course like I say EB can't use the other moves of its you know any Pokemon that's pretty much around it like any of her um 
I was gonna say it in a Pikachu episode. Going like a, a Pikachu and a EB kind of combo. I mean, we've seen it already a couple of games. But yeah, we see like all the Pokemon and stuff like that, of course. Um, they're using this move and stuff like that, of course. We've seen it like other episodes as well, so. Oh, yeah, do we feel like an episode? I can't remember what we feel like. Of course, Sylveon, you know, of course, Chloe's like journey and stuff like that, pretty much, though, so yeah. Again, the not clone episode, of course. Them just, you know, pausing, going back and forth. Yo, Chloe has a clone, oh my gosh. Um, yeah. Again, another look like again, we already had that with the Hundo in that episode. It's like really cool and unique, though. So there goes over their episode, which actually was probably honestly really good. Like the concept episode was really good. Again, the double clothing thing, they kind of played off, played off as a joke, maybe because they were right there done and everything. So, not kind of missing anything there. Just, just moving on at this point, though. But yeah. But yeah, though, like I said, um, pretty simple, pretty easy, like I said, though. Um, I'm sweating my butt off. Again, that shower really made me really feel good. But yeah, using all the moves, working together, different combinations. Yeah, bada boom, bada ping. WED, of course, is Luana. Uh, when she's talking about her in the, the Lola, so that one was pretty cool as well. Um, but yeah, of course, like pretty much how they met, Alana and um, um, EB, how they met, how Chloe and EB e e met. Like, even Alana mentions, like, Ash, you know, does his own thing with his Pokemon. Chloe pretty much has to do the same thing with her, but um, okay, her and EB pretty much both. Well, EB is a girl, she is already from Chloe's EB as a girl at this point. He, she even says she in like one episode, I believe, for journeys. So yeah, but yeah. Like I said, though, on the other hand as well. Um, again, like I said, um, you just kind of talk about it and stuff like that. Of course, you know, Sandy, um, long as EB is pretty much wants to be itself. You know, I don't want to walk into every Pokemon. That would have been kind of cool, makes sense because of the water. Um, you know, a lot of like water, water stone, Vaporeon, another water, Vaporeon leader. But every, you know, every series has to fix on every evolution, just in case you know, if you're new a player, because everybody, what going on is new, it's pretty much me for kids. I forget what sword and shield on the switch, I'm charging it right now. So yeah, it's pink, because my, me and my sister sword, share, share the switch, and we just, she's, the Sailor Moon did up, though, pretty much, like, you can get to it there. So, you guys see it? I think you guys can see it. I think you guys can see it, but yeah. Um, again, she is just, co it's cosmetic, pretty much, though, but I don't care, I'm still gonna play it anyway. So yeah. Duels right here. Um, yeah, how they met and everything. Um, Bond, her and Yamper, her and Eevee. Uh, what else? This is, um, also an episode where Goku got her attack duel, which wasn't a bad episode. I know it didn't really do well for my channel though, but I don't care. So, I mean, I know, whatever. It's, whatever, it's, whatever, it's a video. Woohoo. But yeah, of course, you know, it's basically shows like how they came together pretty much. How they all work together and everything. Yeah, Chloe and Evie are always happy with each other. Of course, Rocket comes in and tries to interrupt them. They're doing their own thing. We see the Chloe and Dawn episode, how they were pretty much one and bond together. Not a bad episode, though. Again, just, again, just how Dawn was too horny here. They're like, oh yeah, we're gonna bring her back again, because we feel like it. <laughs> really? He's a cameo or something. Don't. And yeah, just rip silent, too. Like, just rip silent, though. So, yeah. Then, of course, right here is basically much, pretty much, um, more the same stuff as well, so, yeah. Yeah, of course, the yeah, performances, everything. Dark Ride, Cresselia. Again, just learning life lessons, typical stuff. Dark Ride, the boy, go, you know, I had to mention in this video. Yeah. But I've been there, you know, bad episode and everything. Yeah, of course, it ends off there. Like I said, nothing. Like I said, crazy, crazy, crazy. But yeah, like otherwise, um, not a bad episode. Um, again, just pretty much recapping everything. Like I said, I pretty much said everything I need to say. That some probably good guy in the video there for sure. But again, more of a shorter video. I know you guys probably expected a oh my gosh, Chloe freak out video because I actually didn't really do like Chloe. I'm of course going in now. The Serena episode was a pretty good example. Bring back Serena. Um, again, I will like every Chloe episode around me. I have above just so you guys can see all those. Actually, yeah, Chloe theme video. Yeah, I like Chloe because again, she's completely different. Um, yeah. I don't know what I like Chloe because she was completely different in the series. She doesn't know what she wants to do in life. Her and Evie do not know what they want. They're perfect for each other. I love it all. It's just a good overall. I love their relationship. They don't know what they want to do. Serena was a perfect example, you know, of Evie was just scared, but they only evolved into his own thing, person, to the screen they did. They were both perfect sync with each other perfectly well. With Serena and Evie, of course, Chloe and Evie can really good episodes, really good stuff. I might just screenshot every big moment from every episode, and I'm just gonna, again, probably screenshot. Get every moment from every episode, just gotta put her on one thumbnail for Chloe, because again, I love Chloe so much. That's why I like it. She's not like gym leader, she's not trying to be a cook, she's not trying to be a dragon master. I'm just bringing up examples. She doesn't want to, you know, it's like, kind of like how Serena was. Like, Serena didn't know what she wanted to do, we did what she wanted to do. She slowly figured out what she wanted to do. Pokemon showcases, which are just contest 2.0, so who cares? Um, I that was kind of like, yeah, Serena was uniquely different. I feel like she was kind of like Chloe in that way, like, you, Serena was uniquely different than. It's like, yeah, let's do the contest again. And it's like, man, you already did that when we met you. Try to do it with Iris. At the time when Iris was coming out, they wanted to do something different again. Blood Girl was meant to be a soft reboot because, you know, 
tomboy, you know, girl, gym leaders from the games. Yeah, we, uh, we get that. But it's like, at the same time, it's like, man, at that time, black and white didn't suck, though. But now it, it's pretty okay. It's not as bad. It's not as bearable. It's not as hard to, to swallow. But overall, again, it's super cool stuff there. But yeah, um, but yeah, though, like I said, um, let me zoom in a little bit. But yeah, but like I said, though, um, don't think of it. But like I said, though, I just why I like Chloe, though. She's completely different. She does not know what she wants to do in life. Everybody thinks she's a good researcher like her dad, but she does not want to be what's kind, of, which was kind of obvious. But now she's going to her own character, doing everything she can possibly possibly can to grow her dream. But at the end of the day, if they do nothing for her, I'm fine with that. She's unique. She's different. She's a breath of fresh air. She does have to have that connection with nothing and whatever. Just there. I love her for that. I love her design. I love her. Oh, she just has like Eevee. She doesn't have a whole team of Pokemon yet, but... She couldn't feature, and yeah, that's what I like about Chloe. She's just completely different. That's probably why she is my favorite Pokemon girl. Just because again, it beats you know, like May, Dawn, typical thing, you know, contest. Woohoo! Yay, Serena. Woohoo! I'm sorry to say that. I do like the characters perspectively grow up with them, but at the same time, it's like yeah, it, that contest thing can get still really, really fast. She tried to do something different with Iris, which wasn't a bad idea, especially now with Journey is being out and being a thing, you know, connecting the series and everything. Of course, because Journey is pretty much every series coming out the one. Yeah, I think um. Yeah, I was got a lot of respect, especially the last, uh, the last episode we for to the end. Boy, that was a good episode. But yeah, of course we already know the next episode is going to be with the Chloe and Evie again, so... Yay, more love we got like that. Again, these cool, again, uh, stuff like this I can just go all out, talk about, it's fun and easy. But yeah, um, that's why I pretty much like Chloe. She's completely different. Um, and, yeah, completely different, doesn't know what she wants to do, and I just like that. Again, nothing crazy, nothing different, just, she doesn't know what she wants to do, and she does everything, so she just... Be there so she can just experience it and have fun. And she slowly does that. It goes from nothing bland to her own character. Again, she ended up doing nothing. She did she doesn't you know, have a dream or whatever. It's cool. Going close going closer to closer to Evie, doing everything in the world, traveling the world. If she ends up traveling the world like Ash does and go do, I would love that. You know, she didn't really do that much serious. She did a lot though, but do a cool thing of her own world being on her own. I love that. I love that. Like, uh, uh, like maybe like a Chloe spinoff. I'm just saying that's how I probably play. like, like a spinoff show, like doing her own thing, specifically like just completely, completely, completely doing her own thing, going her own journey, no support, no help, doing growing as a trainer on her own, pretty much. Like, I like, go do it. Like, he just left school. But yeah, uh, yeah, they, they book my age just leave school. Like, I'm just saying that. Like, I do like a spinoff thing. Like, make Chloe do her own. Like, just travel the world. Discover everything, catch her own Pokemon, do her own thing, be a Pokemon trainer by herself, do everything by herself. I would love that. That'd be cool. So yeah, see you guys later. Thank you so much. Like I said, everything I need to say. I keep going. I keep loving this, but fortunately, I'm going to talk about more of this. Probably in the Chloe episode when I review it. So yeah, see you guys later. This was watching. Have a great day. Go ahead. Also, check in. Make sure stay safe. Watch room. Come on, all of you. Going up. I know what matters. A little bit, but we really need to. Best day we can. Go outside. Just grab some coffee. Make sure to subscribe to Discord. Socials everywhere. What you guys think about all this stuff? Of course, like you hated again. Very simple, very easy stuff. Like I said, though. But yeah. Um. I think I said everything you need to say. I love all the episodes. They're all good and everything. So yeah. See you guys over there. Okay, nope.